Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Needs a staff assistant. And the cosy kiosk also needs an assistant as well. So we kind of need some more assistants coming in if we're going to put some of those up. Uh, but that's not what I'm looking for. I've got pictures down through here and posters. We've got a glitchy patch poster right there. Which would fit over on the other side. Gold Star Award. This is the one... Apparently, it's this one right here. Okay, I didn't want to do that. Uh, sell that one. I don't want to do it like that. I don't want to do it with separate items. So I'm going to need to go back up here a second. And I just want to take some benches. Wait, what benches am I using? I'm using bamboo benches in this hospital. So we're going to use the bamboo benches again. But I'm going to put some of these over here. Where I've actually got patients waiting over on this side there so that they can sit down when they need to and I've got a drinks machine in that there I'm gonna put an energy drinks machine in here and a laxative machine just <laughs> just because I can luxury snacks is two grand absorbent snack as well I'm gonna put that one in that's another two grand very expensive lineup of machines that I've just put in there and then I want to come down over here, and I also want to put some of these down this side. I know that this is incredibly expensive, putting all of this lot in. I'll put that one in there, and I'm going to put the laxative machine in. I don't know why I want to put the laxative machine. That leaves me with 28,000 right there. So then I want to go to the staff room over here, and I want to edit this one now. So then I can scroll down through and we can go through all of the posters there. It's a gold star award. That's the one that we're looking for. We can take this gold record, not the gold record, no, the gold star award. And I'm going to put that one. Look at the prestige flying up with these gold star awards. Right, there's level four. I don't know if I can fit them all in here. Can I? Am I going to be able to fit enough in here? They do fit on the wall in behind all of these machines as well, which is fantastic there. And I'll put one more over here. There, I've got level five staff. Nice. Right. So level five staff room with gold star awards. Just like that. It's the first time I've ever used all of these gold star awards right there. I think that's brilliant. I like that. I like that we can do that. We have done this. We've got uh, another 25k points by doing it. That's not so bad. That's not so bad at all. We're down to minus 70 grand. We just lost another patient somewhere. Doctor to resolution or at lab, least. please. We didn't lose the patient so much as... Right. You're supposed to be working in here. I still got another patient in there. I got one patient that wasn't successfully treated. Go to work... In here a minute. Deal with one patient. Right, you you got an appointment in the lab. Oh, Doctor we're waiting. Correcting call. We're waiting for that one to be repaired. That's why. Right. Be great to work in a really spacious environment with lots of luxury furnishing. Something really prestigious. Get a level 4 fluid analysis. Some of our patients are looking a bit ropey. We need to get them seen faster. I absolutely agree. We do need to get them seen faster. Uh, I've got 10 grand at the moment. 28, 29. Right. A special report right there. We cured 5 out of 7 patients. We get 10 grand for that. Uh, our doctor discovered a new illness, placid reflux. Overwhelmed by how calm life can be away from the mainland, the body has been sent into a state of shock and total chemical imbalance. Sufferers must be stabilized before they can be shut down. We'll send, them for we'll send the patient for treatment in our injection room. Right, I got 20 grand. I need to get a level 4 fluid analysis. So we've got quite a lot of patients now that are low on health. And they haven't all been seen either, which means that most of them are going to go and die. My cure rate is 68. I got all of these new patients in here. 
This is not good. We need them to be processed faster. I need them to be able to be seen faster. And that's now starting to become a problem with these extra, with the increasing numbers in the waves. Like they're getting through the doctors, but I also need them to get through the other rooms quicker so that they can be properly diagnosed and then shifted onwards. Uh, but to be able to properly do that, we need money. And we don't have money. Uh, fluid analysis in here. Edit like this. Uh, I need level four in here. Well, that shouldn't be difficult. So I'm going to do the same thing that we did just now. And I'm going to put the gold star awards. I know that there's a few people. I've, I've heard it said before that this is it's a bit of a cheat. And yeah, I agree. It is a bit of a cheat really doing it like this. But um, it works. And it's reasonably cheap as well. There, fluid analysis level four. Job done like that. And then I want to go in here. Well done, we successfully completed that challenge. So I got 28,000. Is there anything else that I want to buy or spend or do before, like that course right there? Unfortunately, I can't put another course going. Uh, I've still got one day. Uh, well, not one that I've got to pay for anyway. So there we go. The course is now finished, but we're 97 grand in the hole. Spree. We have a curing spree. Let's get our staff member promoted. Ward management has now finished. So I'm now able to go and start training up some of my other uh, people. So I'm going to start off by training up my assistants. Uh, those two right there. I've got another assistant over here. Are there any? Well, uh, we can soon find out. Trainers available, uh, courses available, customer service level 2, there, you, right there like that. I've got no more trainees available on this one, so we can start this training 18 to 20 days. So that's customer service level 2 to assist the people here with their customer service. Now, most of these patients that are showing the hearts like that, they are about to keel over and die. They're not going to make it. So I can either boot them out of the hospital. Minus 10. Essentially bad and unsafe. I wouldn't recommend it for anyone looking to get better. Though not without its bright spots. My reputation has taken a hammering there. Unfortunately. And here go all of my patients keeling over and dying. He's got placid reflux. He's heading over for treatment. He's gotten treatment there. You are waiting for surgery although uh, that person has just died you're about to die you're not even going to get into no the health depleted they've just died uh, just a few seconds out from actually getting there successfully you've made it into the helixer which means that you do have a chance training course complete yes that person did successfully make it right staff promotion i've got assistants being promoted again so there's one there and then another assistant there and then another assistant right there so what that's telling me is that i need to promote my assistant i need to do more training for them in here i should need to go there and customer service level three i've got three of them that can now take on that little bit of training but who else have we got uh, a janitor, I got my assistants here who I would like to have more of that. Oh, wait a minute. Should I get them with motivation? Except, I've, well, I've got one there with motivation. Uh, the ward management skill. I don't want to remove the ward managers at the moment. They're busy getting stuff done in here. That nurse there is ready for ward management level 5. But my doctors, they're not doing anything at all. So we could put these in. And I know that I've got... If I go courses available here, I know I've got general practice level 5 that I can roll out. I've only got one other doctor at the moment that can do that level 5. But that's at least the start. So we'll get that training course going. And then uh, hopefully those doctors will be ready by the time we get our next... Um, or, uh, the next wave coming in. Reports of electrical storms in the area. Okie koki. Uh, you guys, I'm hoping that you're in here for treatment rather than diagnosis. It does look like it. You're in there, Shadow Boxer. Looks like they've been cured. 
He's cured, and you're over here, Vested Insects. You're cured as well. I've got three more people that are awaiting treatment somewhere. There's one person over here. He's just been cured as well. Someone failed Janitor, treatment. to fix counterfeit, please. Surgery failed. Uh, one more patient somewhere. Where is this patient? Where is the patient? There's no one there. There's no one over here. Uh, you're looking for work. Cures, cures over there. Discharge, no. Hospital is in debt. 6,000 right there. Tell you what, the hospital's debt is not doing too bad at the moment. I got one patient somewhere. Where is this patient? Ah, right. Well, wherever they were, they've now been dealt with. And we are minus 123. Required to fix X -ray machine. That one's 178. That one's got 42,000 left. I'm kind of hoping that I don't need to take out too many more loans. I'm kind of hoping that our loans will be able to be um, repaid and then not used. And that has finished. General practice level 5 has finished just in time. That is absolutely spot on perfect right there. Uh, so now we can have a look down through. I kind of want to roll these out. I'm going to do that right now. I know that they will be... No, I don't want you in there. Um, I want to go courses available in here. And we've got ward management level 5 would be great. But I can't do that because I can't afford it. So it's ward management here. I've got uh, level 4. That's the one that we want. So trainers available is going to be that nurse. And then I'm going to take these two nurses here to learn level 4. We'll roll that one out. Before the big influx of patients starts getting over there, we can work through this one. 21 days. So it'll take a minute or two for them to sort of process. You're tired already. Really? I suppose it was because he was doing the, um, the other stuff. But anyway, we've got 125 people pushing through here. So let him go and have his break a minute. Throw up into the bin. Sheer stress of it all. And then go over in here and, and, and chill out for a bit. And then you guys can get to work in the doctor's offices. I've got quite a few doctor's offices here. And then once that's done, ward management, that will head back. They will be on, they'll be sort of being dealt with. It should work out well. At least this is what I'm hoping. And... Like all of the other doctors and that, that that's that's not doing too bad. So I've uh, at the moment we're 125 patients. I have cured one patient. Somewhere I've already cured a patient. I think he must have gone through either into the jab master or one of our pharmacies. It's the pharmacy one that's usually the illnesses in there. They they run through pretty quickly, and your training is now done. Let's have a look through again. Assistants can stay where they are for a minute, definitely. That nurse right there is going to have ward management level 5. Uh, treatment nurses. Have I got any other treat? I've got one treatment nurse there that needs a bit of training. And then I've got these over here. So that doctor there, he's only got level 1. I'm going to train him now. I'm going to actually get him trained in general practice. And we're going to start sort of working our way up on that. So I'm going to keep those. are That's 140, 140, 140. His is 130 and his is 130. That dude's on a break. I'm going to take him and have him do it. It's 33 days. Good gravy. That's, only, that's 31 days. All right. You know what? Yeah, roll them out. They can go. There's going to be a month. It will mean that the queues will wait a bit longer. Uh, but I've got four doctor's offices here working. So that's all right. Uh, you need promoting as well, like that, which means that you're probably going to be ready to do your gen your level 4, level 5, I think, maybe, training. And now we're heading deep into debt. We've sort of hit that point where we really start going deep into debt. But I've got really well-trained nurses over here now. I don't want to move the bed. Uh, I got you in here. You got level four ward management, and they're actually pretty close to level five ward management. This 
Deceased patients are reminded that there's nothing here for them now. Supernatural warning, a band of ghosts are haunting the hospital. I've got janitors. They ought to be able to deal with that. I've got several ghosts haunting our hospital right now, and this is starting curing to become a problem. Spree. And we've got a curing spree. Earn 200,000. This is good. Wait, wait a minute. I got the staff request. I don't have a thingy challenge over here going on, do I? Right, I've got this one here. That's Kinder's one. I think uh, I completed that. I can't do. I can't help you anymore, Kinder. Cheese on the chalkboard. This is me over here. I completed my time to research. I completed cure patients. I completed that one as well. I can't do anything until someone else helps me there. Dead weight down here. What can we do on this one? Jimmy J. This one is uh, earn two hundred thousand. I'm going to do that one. Because that one right here, now is the time to earn 200,000. Now we're just on the verge of starting all of our treatments. And we've also got a curing spree as well. See? 13 grand just came in from that dude. I got another one over here. He's going to be a bit more money coming in. Um, I know that I'm deeply, deeply in debt. Training course complete. Excellent. Right, then we can go over this way. What other patients have I got, like, being treated at the moment? Have, have I got anyone in any of the more complex rooms at the moment? Doesn't look like it, to be honest. I got these ones, like, work doing in the pharmacy, the seven grand Dr. right there. The Deluxe Clinic. Got the Deluxe Clinic. There's um, people in the wards. They're being treated, and it's helping very nicely. <laughs> This is Two Point Radio with Ricky Hawthorne. And if you're feeling a bit under the weather, you're in luck because my voice is the best medicine. Unless you're really sick, in which case you should go to a hospital. Okay. Dr. Jason Casserole. He's working in Megascan. To be honest, his best bet, she's the one that I want to do some training with. I want to get her with Diagnostics Level 2. Well, I actually also wanted to train her in the Mega Scan. That was the uh, radiology. I wanted to train her in radiology so that she could do more diagnosis over this side. So we'll do that. We'll, keep you, we'll put you into radiology. Uh, Dr. Jason Casserole over there. He's got a pretty good teaching speed. 21 days right there. I'm going to have him come round and do the training. And then he needs to have some training himself in uh, diagnostics as well. And, and I think that overall, that is going to help things out. It's going to help us with earning our money. It's going to help us with a whole load of things. So we've got our curing spree at the moment. It seems um, we've lost that one. Doctor. It seems generally that the curing spree works quite well. You need level three in there not really changed the the curing spree works quite well early on like we get quite a lot of easier easier illnesses to treat early and then later on it, it kind of like builds up a bit more uh you're coming in here after this patient they're getting their sandy crack dealt with and then we've got the bird one coming in okay we've got more We're close to award season let's have a look in here we haven't got no deaths just hasn't happened that's, that's just not happened. Open all. I got everything else in here. Rising star, employer of the year, patient's choice, most prestigious, best research, hospital of the year, best teaching hospital. But we have not got the no deaths. <laughs> I don't think that's going to happen. I wonder, if you, I wonder if it's even possible to get all of it. I suppose it is, so long as you can very carefully monitor the patients and their health as they work through the hospital. So, in theory, it should be possible. Dead weight, we just managed to do that one. Well, we should manage to do that one quite easily. Uh, generate a thousand research points. Let's go to that one over there. Research project in here. I got a load of stuff going. Bins will become full. That one's out of 8,000 points there, so that one can just keep working. I've got another staff promotion here. There's another doctor being promoted up so that he is super happy. And uh, you got two days left on this training course in here. So that dude right there, he needs to stay here. 
Training, spree. training course complete. So I'm going to go straight back to there. And it's him that was doing the training. Uh, it's Dr. Jason Casserole right there. You. I want you trained in diagnostics level. Oh, it's just basic diagnostics, isn't it? Right. I got level four diagnostics there. I don't have anyone with level five diagnostics yet. That's something that I need to work on. Your 120, 130, 130. I haven't got any bonuses. So I'm going to take... Actually, you can do it. Dr. Gwendolyn Doolittle. Will it... No, I won't. I won't swap them around. I want to be careful that I don't, like, take the wrong person out. Working in X-ray. Uh, working in the DNA lab, which I kind of need you to keep doing. Fluid analysis. Cardiology. Looking for work. Right, well, if you're looking for work, you can come over here and you can do the training. And uh, I don't want to train anybody else, so let's get that one underway. How long was that? That's 21 days. That's not too bad. And we get that little bit of training there rolled out, so that will just aid the diagnosis. I didn't... I was thinking of having the doctor who works in the Helixer do it, but she's busy. She she needs to be working in the Helixer. And I got my treatment dude over here who is actually treating people working in here. We've got our curing spree active as well, so we're generating a nice bit of money. Um, not as much as I'd like, but we have... Ooh, actually... Okay, a lot of money just came in there right at the very end of the month, which I think is fantastic. I like that. And we've got Curing Spree. We've got 20 people in a row right now. So the Curing Spree is doing all right. We, we are making a bit of money with our Curing Spree. I've got a, a nurse here who's getting suited and booted, ready to come in. And then we've got surgery. They've got Pain Apple that they need to have treated. When I got money, I'd like to get that surgeon trained in level 4 surgery. A wiggy visit. Wiggy Silverbottom. He's on his way in. Wait, is that trained? That, that, oh, it's finished already. Okay, fine. What do we train now? The Actually, the, well, I can't do the assistance with the training that I would like, which is level 3 training in there. I have got a janitor here who is a head janitor that needs to be trained. So your courses that you can do can do emotional intelligence, mechanics or maintenance level 2. And I think we will go with maintenance level 2 in there. Trainer there, I've got one who's got uh, maintenance level 3 and then trainees available, head janitor and head janitor. They've both got ghost capture. They've actually, you've got mechanics, which allows the upgrades, but uh, they've both got motivation. We'll get both of those trained in maintenance level two. Start training. Required in GP's office. Yeah, get them all trained up in maintenance level two, and that means that they're able to repair machines just a tiny little bit faster. Hospital patron arriving now. Right, where is Wiggy? We've got to make sure that he's looked after, I think. Patient is unhappy. They're storming out. They waited too long. What was wrong with you? Too hot. Okay. You over here, you're ready for doing... Uh, to, to get a little promotion. Um, what were you waiting for, exactly? Turbo Plunger over here... That's a doctor's. Yeah, this is a doctor one. That might be part of the problem. I might doctor need another doctor. In research. Doctor required in research. Generate my... Th it should be fine. Uh, right. Uh, staff promotion. You're ready for senior janitor to head janitor. Promote you. I'm minus 180,000 right now. Okay, so I've... Ooh, we got an emergency. DNA emergency. Lemon soul. Yes, bring them in. Bring them in for treatment. Patients for DNA lab arriving. They all need to be treated in here, though. 
Well, this is the only one that they can be treated in. Staff should secure patients before securing themselves. This is the only one that they can be treated in because that doctor... Uh, well, I've, I've set the room to make sure Karen, that does happen. There shouldn't be a fire. Hospital attractiveness is 70%. I'm not going to bother with that. Our counterfeit is on fire. We need a, fan, a janitor and a, a fire extinguisher. Where's our counterfeit? Oh, this one. I have no janitors over this side. There's a janitor. He's running in. Required in DNA lab. Kind of need you to do something. There, he's grabbing the fire extinguisher. I think that dude is already cured. He's putting that one out. And I just lost my curing spree. I've only got 18,000 in the hole now. We're on the 31st of March, so we're pretty close to doing all right. We're back up to 150. Still got 52 patients to cure. I haven't borrowed any extra fire money. Test. There's really a fire. That's the test. Borrowed no extra money. I could have done, and I could have made a difference here. I could have repaid some of the Patience loan. Needed in mega scan. I chose not to do that, though. Um... Stab promotion right there. Boost you up like that. Uh, let's go into here and see what we've got. So my assistants, I want a level three there. I want you level five. Treatment level four. That's what I want. I want treatment level four, but I don't think I've actually got... Oh, I have got one person trained. Oh, ideal. Right. You're working in the escape room at the moment. I'm going to get my doctors trained up in this, right? We're going to we're going to roll out treatment level 4. It's 42 days that this particular training course is going to take, and it is going to impact the speed at which we're treating our patients, especially all of these over here that are um poor health. But I still think it's going to be worth it overall because uh, it's going to help us with the Karen remaining spree. seven waves. Like, we've, we've got a lot of waves of patients that we've still Janitor got to treat. To repair Jackmaster. Got a lot of waves of patients that we still need to treat. So you need to be promoted there as another nurse promotion like that. Um, you, haven't, you haven't even been diagnosed yet. Uh... Diagnosis is 83% certain. Send them for treatment. Where are they going? Tooth mutiny. Right, I'll send them off for tooth mutiny treatment. He's level one in the pharmacy queue. Is he going to get there before he dies? He's hanging around a lot here. He's, he doesn't seem to be doing a great deal. I'm hoping he get there. I'm on 32 grand now. I could have changed this. That course there hasn't even started. Right, cancel the course. Cancel it completely. And instead, I will do a different course. I will do one that I don't have anybody trained in. So it's either surgery or ward management. Ooh, or, or the other one. Um, not the radiology, uh, no, 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 customer service level three. I could roll that out. I could do that right now. Actually, I think I'm going to go with surgery level four, because surgery is like one that I've been wanting to do for a bit. So I put you... Well, I think that's quite enough care and loving attention inflicted upon the patients from myself for today so we will return next time in the meantime if you have enjoyed this episode then could you please head down below and give us a like and if you really enjoyed it then please tell your friends all about me get them to come and watch as well that would be awesome and until next time thank you very much for watching this is Frithgar goodbye and see you later